Hey everybody, Thrift Store Hacker back again, and I found this Krylon looking glass pane at the hardware store the other day. Let's try it out and see if it's any good. I'm going to try it out on two things today. I have this clear glass container here, and I also have this piece of acrylic. I'm not sure if it's going to work on this, but we're going to give it a try. As you can see, I taped off the parts that I did not want to get paint on, and hopefully it'll come out pretty good. I'm going to start by spraying the acrylic. As you can see, it goes on very thin, so you got to watch for runs. I noticed as this is sprayed on, it kind of dries pretty fast, but you have to wait for it to dry up, as I'm doing here, before you put another layer on it. And I'm going to put about two or three layers on this way, and then I'm going to let it dry, and then we'll put another layer on after that. It's interesting to watch this dry. It uh, has a lot of solvent or whatever the agent is in there, and it burns off pretty quick. Even though it's kind of cold outside, I'm uh, kind of at the bottom of the operating temperature for this paint. But it seems to be working pretty well. Since this paint goes on kind of thin, it's actually kind of hard to do on the inside of a container, and I want the glass effect on the outside of the container. So I tried spraying it like this, this really didn't work too well. This approach worked for me as I had some pain in the container from trying to spray it, and I just rolled it around on the inside and got a really good coat on the glass. I think it's going to work out pretty good. This is what the acrylic looked like after the first couple of quick coats on there. I'm going to throw a couple of more on there. And... Uh, it seems to be working out pretty good. It's it's nice and shiny. It should look pretty good when we peel off the tape and look at it through the other side. We'll just let these set in the sun and dry. I'll probably let them sit here for about an hour or so before I peel off the tape. All right, here it is. That actually came out really good, pretty shiny. Uh, any of the scratches on the outside of the glass are actually just scratches in the glass. Uh, the Krylon coated it quite well, left a really nice, pretty reflective uh, surface. All right, let's check out the acrylic. Oh, that came out really good. So you can see the plastic itself was pretty hammered and torn up, but the product itself worked amazingly. That's, that's a pretty reflective finish. Well, this turned out pretty good for what it is. Uh, the glass and the acrylic was really scratched up, but the Krylon itself works amazingly. Uh, I highly recommend this product, and I highly recommend practicing before you actually paint the product that you want to make. Well, that's all I have for you today. Until next time, build stuff, have fun, be safe, and wear a mask.